hello, uh, I'm with uh, Dr. Mohammed Haska. Zahal. Dr. Mohammed Zahal and Zahalka. And uh, we are at the Alpha Gate implant booth. He's the CEO. Welcome, Doctor. Hello, welcome. We are welcoming all of you here in our booth at EDIC Dubai 2024. And what he actually told me before the interview, it's amazing. He is having implants of different connections, which is compatible with almost all the big systems in the world. Well, our system of AlphaGate system is honestly made by dentists for dentists. When you are understanding the needs of each dentist, sometimes you try to change the market, but sometimes you need to help or improve the needs of doctors. In our system, it's we are like compatible for the needs of doctors if they are used to internal hex or if they are used to conical connection different types or a single piece so we adapted that we even improved the prosthetics on those solutions from having a straight abutment until 45 degrees cemented abutment or multi unit the mentality is coming we bring a solutions we are not making it difficult we just making things much more simpler even if you are looking at our surgical kit, it's starting with the word start. Yeah. <laughs> That's how we look at it. Just simplify the system. We understand in the each clinic, there is the dentist, the surgeon, and there is the Prospect. medical personnel, medical assistants. Sometimes when you need to clean it, so to bring the things back, we color coded even the drill. The blue is going back to the blue. Each key is color coded to be back in the position because we understand that everybody needs to be synchronized in the system. Simple to be ready for the next surgery. All of our prosthetics from st standard abutment, healing cap, cover screw, ball attachment, locator, anything, it's used by single key. Single key. That means you don't need a special key for different abutments. It's a one key. It's things just made much more simpler for a daily practice. Our system is having also for different platform single key of insertion or the implants. This is amazing. So try to make it simple, less user error. It immediately get you a higher percentage of success. Absolutely. Well, uh, this is the guided kit, I suppose. Yes, with our uh, guided kit, we had done it like, you just do it like normal implants. So you're starting with a start, and then you choose the line of the length, and you go like this. You don't need extra tools. You don't need extra shirts. It's all going directly by the guide itself. With the sleeve, we can control the hex position. We can control the head prosthetics so, that you are using and it's very very so this is this is really very easy and exciting so you start with the first drill and then you just select the length, the length that you and just it. continue it according to the diameters written yes, oh so this, is, this is easy and simple extra hand, handle or spoon or no, no. Yes. like so it's, it's it doesn't require any sleeves right it's having our sleeve which is we are indicating our in our guide we are indicating where it will be the final hex okay, okay so we are not only controlling the depth the angulation and position but we are controlling also where the hex will be yeah you are actually timing the implant for the prosthesis exactly we're just making the processes process much more easier and simple for everybody this is this is amazing and the surfaces you have implants with two surfaces right yes we have the sla surface a very high purity sla surface super clean surface and we have a special cases the bioactive implant which have a surface of calcium phosphate it is synthetic bone material it's considered the only bone inducer bone uh, material synthetic bone material it's reducing the healing time for six weeks and increasing the success rate of 99.7. Honestly, let's see where we see the major difference or when we should use the bioactive. As we know, the success rate in diabetic patients going down or in compromised patients. Systemically or compromised patients, smokers. Smokers or after extraction or in sinus lift. So we go to the most challenging cases Absolutely. here that's honestly it should be used only the bioactive as it is reduce the healing time that's mean reduce uh, the risk time 
and then you increase the predictability and increase the success rate first. Second, it's a hydrophilic, so you are achieving a direct stem cells on a fully calcium phosphate differentiated surface, and that's how the building is going to be from bone to implant, from implant, implant to bone. bone. Like it's dual osseous integration. Yes. And making a lot of sense for the daily practice when you're having, like if we are in the Gulf, the percentage of diabetic patient is super high. Uh, people above 40 years old, we are almost 50% having diabetic. And also the smokers. And the smokers, but mostly diabetic, it's like super high numbers. Here, a solution for these markets, it is the bioactive. It's a game changer for every doctor in daily practice. Second thing is with our implants that you have from 3.0 diameter. The narrowest, you mean? The narrowest. And then you have from 3.3, 3.75, 4.2, 4.7, 5.2, and 6 millimeter, it's a one platform. That means same apartment, same prosthetics for all the process. This is sleek. This is an easy portfolio. And uh, also, what do we have coming in the next years? Now, in the next year, we are introducing the zygomatic implant, the adaption of AI planning on guided surgery. Oh, this, is, this is amazing. Yes, it's just working on simplifying the planning of uh, guided surgery because it's time consumer, a uh, lot dependent of the user error. That's why we noticed the difficult area it was on the initial planning. Now, the final correction, that's always have to be done by a human, okay? But when you are starting, you need to make it that com with the collection of the data is correct. So it has to be adopted in AI. Now we are working AI planning, and this will be introduced very, very soon. This is amazing. This is amazing. Thank you so much, doctor, for your time. Thank you.